Howdy, Lawn Stars. I'm back, sort of. You're watching me from somebody else's channel. One of my lovely friends on YouTube that has decided to stand behind me and try to support me and try to help me with this very difficult situation that I'm dealing with right now. So to get everybody up to speed, um, last night, late last night, I received an email from YouTube in which they reference one of my live streams stating that I violated community guidelines and that it was strike one. Just a heads up because I get a total of three strikes before they take further action. However, they did not immediately, at the same time really, I got another email from YouTube saying that my account was suspended. They didn't say why, they just said it was suspended and it was over. Um, it sucks. I've tried to reach somebody at YouTube. I was just reminded I have to go through the appeals process, so I've done that. I've actually written a total of three appeals, but it says that they're only gonna look at the first one because they don't care. Um, if you do it multiple times, you just get one. And if they decide against ruling for you, then it's over. You don't get a second appeal. You get one appeal and that's it. So I've stated my case to them, you guys. Um, normally, accounts are only suspended if you're doing all sorts of crazy stuff repeatedly and you get reported and, you know, they find that you did something hateful repeatedly. It's a three-strike rule, so I'm not quite sure why they felt the need to expedite that with me, but they did. Um, some of you have asked, can't you just open another account? Not really. Uh, I have spent three years of my life, thousands, tens of thousands of dollars building this channel. I can't really replicate Texan Candy. Um, I could open an account under a different name, but I'll never be a YouTube partner again because once you're on that list, you don't qualify for it, which means that I can't get paid. And if I can't get paid, you guys, even if it is only a little bit of money every month that goes toward creating content, there is absolutely no way that I can afford to sustain this channel and not be a YouTube partner. So this is what I need. If you are willing to, I would appreciate your support. Stand behind me, reach out to YouTube, write them, fax them, email them, tweet them, whatever you can do to try to get them to reinstate my account. I'd love and appreciate all of you for it. It has been three years of so much work, heart, soul, money, everything. You guys, Texan Candy is not just a channel. It's something I've worked and put my whole heart into. It's the connections that I've made, the friendships that I've established with people, the experience that I've had. I've done a lot of growing up in the three years that I've had it and I hate to see it go this way. So. I implore you, please do what you can. Ask YouTube to overturn the decision and give me my channel back. Don't know what I did wrong, but whatever it is, I won't do it again. I love Tex and Candy too much to, you know, do anything that's going to possibly have it taken from me the way that it was. I don't know why I'm being made an example out of, but that's how it feels. So please do whatever you can. Reach out to YouTube. Ask them to give Tex and Candy her channel back. You can do this by email. I don't know their email address. I'm just saying that I think some people are saying they're emailing, so I'm assuming you can Google something. But fax them, write them, tweet them, whatever you can do. All right, you guys, that's it for me. I hope that we have good news here soon, but I was told the appeals process could take weeks. Hopefully not, but it can. Love you all, and I hope to see you on my own channel very soon. Bye.